So here on the workbench we have a very large box and if you've read the, the title you know what's in it so let's get started. So there it is, a nice CMP hard case. And before I open it, let me just go over the process of buying this. Um, there's a lot of other videos out there about the ordering process of the CMP, so I won't get into that. I'll just talk about my situation. So uh, October of 2021, the end of October is when I submitted the order. It was delivered, um, I think, November 1st, 2021, and then two or three days later, they announced that the field grades had sold out. So I wasn't quite sure if I was going to end up getting one if I got in. I know I got in before the deadline, but I don't know exactly how the process is. But here's a, a field, gate, field grade M1 Garand in front of me, and from that point on, it, it was pretty much crickets. I think the end of April 2022 is when I got an email from them basically saying, we're working on your order. It was another month until I saw it on my account on the CMP eStore. And then here I am um, today is July 19th. That's when it arrived. It was shipped July 18th. So quick shipping but uh, a nine month wait to, to get it so without further ado let's open it up this is my first M1 Garand so I'm very happy to get it I've been acquiring clips at uh, gun shows I have a whole bunch so now I just need the rifle to shoot them with I'm, I'm liking what I see so far. Let's just take a look at that. Now I put a sticky note in with my order and they don't really need to, to go off of what you're requesting, but I put a sticky note for GI Wood, which uh, it looks like I got. I, I wanted something, you know, it's been there, done that type of look. And I didn't want one of the new stocks that they've been providing. You know, I, I ordered a field grade. I wanted uh, something that looks like it's been in the field. So this is a definitely a field grade. The finish on the op rod looks a little off. I don't know if that means it's a new part or what. Let's see when it was made. Okay, so it's a Springfield Armory, and it's a uh, 2 million serial number. I, I don't have the production dates in front of me, but from what I looked at, I'm pretty sure that's a World War II date. Um, just look up here at the, the muzzle end. So it looks like all the wood is... Uh, is GI, which is which is great. The hand, upper hand guard here is definitely not a new production, but the finish is a little bit mismatched. I mean, I I personally like it when they're mismatched. I think it's more interesting. So I'm mean, I'm just taking it in right now. Uh, I've always wanted an M1 Grand. I've kind of had the uh, opportunity to buy one from the CMP for a long time. They, they've always been there. But, you know, if something's always been there, then there's other stuff that you might prioritize ahead of it. And, and that's just the case of what I've done. So, you know, enough's enough. I'm, I'm glad to, to finally get one. Can't wait to, to get it to the range.
Okay, so I did a little bit of more research, and this uh, serial number 2,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,000,